Well, service learning, I think, provides uh, one of the ways in which you can engage students uh, in the class and help them motivate them. Uh, one of the things that I've heard very often uh, from students that have been in service learning courses is that uh, service learning uh, made it much more relevant, it made it more exciting, and uh, for many students they've said it, it really was a reason they've continued to pursue their work in a, a particular area. As a faculty member at Fresno State, uh, faculty have a tremendous opportunity here because of several reasons, one of which is that Fresno State is recognized by the Carnegie Foundation as an engaged campus. So we have a national recognition for this, and many of our faculty are already engaging in this very important activity. A second reason is that um, Ernest Boyer, who wrote the seminal book Scholarship Reconsidered, talks about the importance of thinking about the faculty role in one of four areas. Um, obviously in the area of discovery or scholarship research, certainly in the area of teaching and learning, but um, a third area that's very important is the area of um, engagement. So where faculty are taking what they know from the discipline, from theory and research, and applying it and helping their students see the application of that in the real community. So we have the chance to really make a difference in our own neighborhoods, our own community. When I was a new faculty member here at Fresno State, I heard the term service learning, but I I really had no idea what it meant. And so I met with Chris Fiorentino and we had a discussion. I still didn't really know what it meant. I thought it meant I would be providing volunteer activity, but it's so much more than that. It's a synergy between a community partner and you and your students really do benefit from it a great deal. And after being involved with it a few years, it, I'm, I'm confident to say that it's actually reinvigorated my teaching. It's made me feel like I'm doing something worthwhile, like I'm making a true contribution, and that I truly am enhancing the education of my students. There will be bumps along the way, but it's, it's actually the, the best thing about being here at Fresno State. It's a real positive. Many used to say, well, engineering would not want to get involved in service learning, but yet the work that the engineering and construction management students have done for Habitat for Humanity, uh, HOPE program, so many other programs, likewise in business. I mean, I've had people say to me, why would uh, a business uh, major want to get involved in service learning? Well, the, the Craig School of Business has been one of our key leaders in uh, learning how to distribute food and working with those agencies that are involved in that, actually applying some critical business principles of uh, distribution, marketing, uh, even finance that has gotten them involved in service learning. And of course there are other more, much more traditional uh, examples of social work students getting involved, education students getting involved in schools, etc. But when you stop to think about it, service learning really uh, can be utilized in all disciplines and it, it, I think it improves and challenges us to be more creative. Much of the research nowadays shows that students who engage in what we call high-touch experiences, things like working in the community, uh, uh, applying their knowledge in the real world, those students find those experiences transformative, both personally and academically. So taking what you know from the book, from the readings, and applying it to real people, real lives, and that is such a rewarding and enduring, I think, contribution that faculty can make.